Hey Stanford softball fans, this is second baseman Emily Klingeman and I'm here to give you a day in the life in Virginia. Tips that one off the end of the bat, flares into right, diving catch by Emily Klingeman. The current time is 9.30 a.m. and I'm about to go get some breakfast and then I'm gonna go for a run. I'm making an omelet and I made a smoothie. I made some for my dad and I. Um, I figured out yesterday that coconut milk tastes way better than smoothies. I'm out here at my county's turf. Um, I'm alone for the most part, except for like a couple people over there. That's okay. Lots of room. Um, gonna do my workout now. Gonna get some abs. Gonna run, do some sprints. Gonna do some legs. It's gonna be good. So I just finished my workout and I'm the color of the sweatshirt. That's okay. Um, I wanted to show you guys the field that I grew up playing softball at since it's right next to the turf field. This is Kathy Field. Um, this is where I played competitive softball all the way through high school. Um, this is where the Vienna Stars practice and that's who I played for for most of my childhood. So here we have some pitching lanes. There's the turf that I just ran at. Over there is the county's fire station. Um, we have this gazebo. There's the rec center. So here I'll show you the field. It's a little scrappy. That's where you learn bad hops, you know? Many practices here. Many foul pulls down to that pull and back. I'm on a meeting with my athletic trainer, strength coach, and physical therapist. Um, so we do this once a week. Um, we just check in on my workouts and what's up with my knee. Here's some of my French work that I did earlier today. Um, I really like taking my notes on an iPad because I like how pretty it looks. So I am a second year French student. I've been taking French since the eighth grade and I'm hopefully going to minor in it. Now I'm gonna watch my class from today. This is engineering 14, it is solid mechanics. So we learn about free body diagrams, bridges, and basically anything mechanical that does not move. So I just had dinner and it's super nice out still. It's probably like 65 or 70 degrees. So I'm gonna go on a walk. There's this little lake in my neighborhood and I didn't even know it existed until about two weeks ago when my dad took me here and I've lived in this neighborhood for almost two years. So that's kind of crazy, but I'm gonna show it to you guys because it's really pretty. I thought this would be a good time to talk about my major and why I chose that major. So as you can tell by my love of the outdoors, um, I am an environmental type major. I study environmental engineering and my focus is in freshwater systems. I developed a love for the outdoors when I was really young. I just grew up surrounded by this quaint nature. Um, it's not grand like the Rocky Mountains, but it's just quiet rural antique mountains um, the Appalachian Mountains are really eroded so they're they're flatter and they're just you can look for miles and miles and see these hills I just was encaptured by these mountains at such a young age that I wanted to study something where I could be surrounded by this type of beauty every single day of my life. I'm really passionate about my major and I think when I graduate that I want to work in some type of field that works with sustainability as well as providing access to fresh water which is what my major specialization is, fresh water. Um, and I just think it'd be so amazing to work in some capacity with public lands, national parks, um, in these beautiful spaces. Before I go to bed, I wanted to show you guys some of my pretty cool um, treasures from my softball career. Here we have my bookshelf, and probably my favorite thing on this bookshelf would have to be um, this ball. It's my first home run. I hit it my freshman year against Western Michigan. Here I have this award. I'm on the All Madison team for my high school. Here I have both of my state rings. I won states my junior and my senior year. This is our senior year ring, it says back to back. That's the home run I hit my junior year to walk off to win. And fun fact, I also hit a walk off to win the regional championship. This home run was on ESPN in the top 10, which was super cool. The last thing I wanna show you guys is this gift that my mom made me. 
after my freshman year. She got these um, trading cards from the games because my parents were always at the games and she had all of the players sign them. So that's so cool. I was so surprised when she gave this to me. Hopefully I'll get to have these every year following. Alrighty guys, I'm gonna go to bed pretty soon here. It's about 11 o'clock in Virginia. Um, it was super fun to take you guys around my life in quarantine. Hopefully it was interesting and you got to learn a little bit more about me and my high school softball career. Go Card and I'm super excited about the future of Stanford softball and I'm looking forward to being back on the field with my girls.